a very good morning to all of you welcome to ANB exam forum in the series crack CSR 2023 we are bringing previous year questions and in today's session uh, we are going to solve 10 questions of English section okay so without wasting any time let's begin the session student the first question for today's session is which of the following is not synonym of fictitious okay which of the following is not a synonym of fictitious not a synonym okay so if you go for the options fabricated yes fabricated means fictitious counterfeit it is again a fictitious artifacts student the meaning of artifact is some piece of object so the correct answer for this question would be option 3 okay so those who have given option 3 they are right let's see the next question and your time starts now this question is from the filling the blank and there you need to fill the blank with the preposition okay so the statement is on account of his age he is disqualified dash competing okay as uh, in speech directly uh, you can uh, find it he is disqualified from competing okay so from competing is the right answer from is the right answer let's see the next question an ice cream vendor screams ice cream but nobody's buys dash him okay the options are option one with option two off at and off student this question uh, i guess it is wrong the answer should be from okay from is the correct proposition but uh, they have not given in the option okay although their answer key says it's off but i don't think so it is correct okay let's see the next question which of the following sentences is not correct time and tide wait for no man the rise and fall of the tide is due to lunar influence ramu my friend the benefactor have come student so, as you know this ramu is a singular subject so for singular subject instead of have it should be has has model word should be used okay ramu my friend and benefactor has come okay so option three is the correct answer let's see the next question and your time starts now which of the following sentence is not a passive voice okay so student we have seen two to three questions on passive voice okay so you go to this active passive voice very deeply so as you know uh, on the passive voice focus is on action rather than who is performing it okay or otherwise subject receives action okay so out of these four options which of the following uh, uh, subject is receiving an action this one okay the mouse was the prey of the cat okay here the mouse this mouse is the subject and it was action by the whom this cat okay so option 3 is the correct answer for this question let's see the next question which of the following is in passive okay there it is not in passive here they have asked which of the following is in passive so one thing uh, you can do if you are not having knowledge of passive voice active voice just go with by if there is a by word generally they are in passive voice okay and otherwise as i told you earlier focus on action rather than who is performing it so so town was destroyed the focus is on town okay this is the focus or focus this is action basically the town was destroyed by whom by the subject tsunami so this is in passive voice okay whereas if you see the other option okay he kept me waiting here he is the subject okay he is uh, it is not uh, focus on action instead it is focus on the subject 
similarly with option 4 and option 3 okay so option 2 is the right answer let's see the next question choose the correct statement bm means without clothing and covering it is incorrect okay this beer means it is an animal okay second site is a place where building is situated it is not c i t e it is s i t e site site is a place uh, where building is situated coma is a deep uh, state of deep unconsciousness it is not c o double m a it is c o m a is the state of deep consciousness where as this double m a is punctuation mark like this okay so correct statement would be option four space or gap between two things is called a break okay so if there is a two uh, uh, or more thing this is uh, you can say this is a break or if it is broken so that is called break so option four is the correct answer let's see the next question i think this is the last question which of the following sentences could imply the scorpion was standing at the gate okay so these are the four options standing at the gate a scorpion stung the ram okay so this itself is a correct why because standing at the gate who is standing at the gate this first subject so standing at the gate a scorpion stung the ram so the question says which of the following implies a scorpion was standing at the gate so option one is straight away uh, implies that scorpion was standing at the gate okay since it is in the beginning uh, that's why this scorpion implies that it is standing at the gate if you see the other option standing at the gate ram so ram was standing at the gate while ram was standing at the gate a scorpion stung him since it is beginning with uh, uh, this while so ram was standing at the gate not the scorpion ram was stung by the scorpion while he was standing in the gate so who was sta standing in the gate again he he refers to ram so ram was standing in the gate so option one is only the correct answer let's see the next question the meaning of the sentence the thief drove too fast for police to catch a very simple one uh three the thief drove too fast for police to catch means police was not able to catch him so the thief drove so fast that police could not catch him so option one straight away is the right answer let's see the next question uh which one of the following is a correct sentence again uh here this is somewhat related to punctuation okay so how you are putting the punctuation mark uh, depend upon that the uh, statement meaning uh, got changed okay for sale piano uh, the property of musician with carved legs again uh, this is straight away wrong for sale piano doesn't make any sense in english for next for sale comma piano with curved legs property of musician okay so a piano has a curve left so this is correct for sale again it is correct the property of musician is correct so option two is a correct answer let's see the other option for sale piano and the property of musician with curve left so musician with curve left is not uh, the meaningful uh, one so this is incorrect for sale piano the property of musician with curve legs again this is wrong okay so option b for sale piano with carved legs the property of musician is a correct sentence so option two is the right answer so that's it so we have seen uh english questions so we'll bring more questions uh for csi 2023 so till now if you are not subscribed to our channel ANB exam for you you can subscribe it and if you have anything to say you can write in our comment box we will be very happy to answer the course question thank you for watching have a nice day